Hi, welcome back to The Healing Hurt, and in this episode of Clicker Training with Kazoo, I update you on how he's going with picking up his feet and lunging. I was going to do some mounting practice, but something a little unexpected happens and changes my plans. Kazoo is next to perfect with picking up his front feet, and he barely fights me at all. He's just as good on both sides. Now here comes the slightly trickier part. With his left hind, he's a bit stubborn and doesn't want to pick it up. But once I have picked it up, he leaves it on the hoof stand for ages. I'm really proud of him considering where he was just a week or so ago. However, his right hind is a little bit of a different story. I don't know if he was maybe a little bit sore, but he doesn't want me picking up his hoof and keeps pushing into me and then he starts to kick out. I try to make it easy for him by straightening him out. Now he lets me put his hoof on the stand. I do repeat this foot a couple of times, but this video is already pretty long, so I leave it out. Now, moving on to London. He is already moving off so much better than when we started. He amazes me by how well he picks up new things. Today I'm rewarding for full circles of war. He doesn't want to walk on here because there are a couple of tradies doing something in the bush. I should have guessed this is what would happen next. that clip in slow-mo for you so you can see his impressive turning skills. He is quite alarmed by the tradies as you can see by his face and he has another spook that I still wasn't expecting hence why I got a bit dry. I'm just letting him figure out what is going on by himself at the moment. I don't need to rush him. This is my mum trying to show you what he's scared of but I don't know if you could really see it. I now walk him over as he has calmed down a little bit to go check things out. Fast me was very amused by the whole situation as I didn't expect him to be so spooky just over a couple of guys. I walk him up and down the fence line so that he can have a good look over and see what's happening. Take him over to the poles that are set up in the arena just to take his mind off it. He 
gets lots of scratches for facing his fears. I've sped the video up here because it gets very repetitive and otherwise the video would have been over 20 minutes long. Here I want him to be comfortable standing away from me as he tends to get very close and pushy when he's scared or nervous over something. Seems to have calmed down a bit, so I try going back to the lunging. Not after long, I can see that he's still very distracted and not listening as he is watching the really scary tradies, so I decide to leave the lunging there for today. I take him over to the fence again. He's really good and goes right up to the arena fence this time and I was th thought he was getting better until he has another spook. The tradies were so nice and apologetic by the way, but I reassured them that he was actually really good for Kazoo to get used to stuff like this. Walk him back around the poles again to try to divert his attention before taking him back to that corner. Really good and doesn't spook this time. He gets a click and treat for standing there still and calm so he knows he's doing a good thing. I take him round in another loop and I think this time he's realised that they're just people as he goes right past and into the corner with no problems. I'm now doing his safety bends because if I were riding him, I'd want him to know how to do them. Then of course he gets kisses and cuddles for being a very good boy. To finish off the day, I do a little bit of liberty just for fun. He was doing really well, but he's like, Mom, I can't walk over poles when I have to watch the bright things in the bushes. He's not a big fan of poles, as you can see.
Thanks so much for watching. I didn't end up doing any mountain with him today as he had enough stress and I didn't want him spooking when I was leaning over the top of him. It was a really fun learning opportunity for him and I'm actually glad that he got a bit spooked by that. If you enjoyed, please give this video some love. I'll see you next time with The Healing Head.